WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of very sunny and pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This is our 11 a.m. update, and we begin our day with a mixed bag out there. You've got the Dow up 12 points, S&P up 12 points, NASDAQ 119 points. Russell's off 5, semis down 35, Tranny's off 154. You've got gold trading out at 24.68, that's up 5 bucks. Silver's off 8 cents, trading at 27.53. Light's recruit up 50 pennies, trading at 76.69. Natural gas is flat, and the 30 year treasury up nearly 1 point, printed out at 122.26. <coughs> Let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart. We'll begin with the ES Mini upper left hand side. Well, that's not it. We'll begin with the ES Mini upper left hand side. Yesterday formed a confirmed Gartley buy pattern. Now, I've got two different sets of profiles. Let's talk about this set of profiles. This would suggest that a counter trend move would end at the 54, 56 level. We'll take a look at my other set of charts during the uh, Trader's Edge show. Spot volatilics is falling, trading below uh, yesterday's low. That's a bullish sign for the S&P 500, likely to see the rally continue to move higher today. The spot VIX, more likely than not, is targeting the 1710 level. That's its 50-day exponential moving average. The NQ yesterday also completed a Gartley buy pattern, nice little bull sash candle. And here, if this is only a counter trend move using this set of profiles, price would find resistance at 18770. So that's the level to be watching. In the case of the U.S. dollar index, it's consolidating with inside its daily profile between 102 and a quarter and 1. 0326. Gold is consolidating inside its profiles as well between 2417 and 2537. We did get a buy the D point or a Gartley buy pattern yesterday inside of silver. We have a new profile that is forming and that profile's got support at 2679, resists up at the 2935 level. When it comes to lights we crude, it does have an A to B equals CD pattern. It is still in essence in effect. Price is trading into its sell zone. And the sell zone for lights we crude is between 76 bucks even Stephen and 78.16. In the case of natural gas out here, we did get a close just above the top of its profile here. So let me make sure. Close was 2.12. Yes, just above the top of its profile. A second close above that level today, that will be 2.122. We should see a rally up to the prior swing point. That's its target, $2.30. And finally, we take a look at the 30-year Treasury, which has a sell the D point top. Yesterday, we closed back inside its profile. Today, we're trying to trade above it. If we do close above 122.19, it could suggest that we go target that sell the D point top. Folks, stay tuned for the Traders Said Traders Ed show, if you will. But if you're off to start your Friday, I want you to have a fabulous Friday, a wonderful weekend, and then I'll look forward to seeing you on Magical Monday. Take care, folks.